Hi everyone. Today I am going to show you and explain you in detail how to make ALV cells, individual cells as editable and how to make individual cell as colored. Generally in ALVs we can do the entire column as ed editable by marking edit field in field catalog as X. By that entire column will be editable and we can make entire column as color by passing emphasize equals to the color name. With this we can achieve the entire column level editable and coloring. But if we want and the requirement is based on some condition if you want to make few cells as editable and if you want to make few cells as colored then we need to follow one very simple approach to achieve that. I am going to show you in the program and I'll explain you in the program then you can understand in a better way. Now in the first step in the in the third line we declared a call which is a type pool in this it has different color names we don't worry about that. Next I am declaring the type. This is the type I am going to use it for displaying the ALV output. This will be the reference type that we have declared. In this if you observe there are four fields from the table and first field is a style which is of type LVC underscore style. It's an internal table. So we need to pass uh, relevant values to this internal table and the other one is colors. This in this we need to pass the field name and what is the color that we want to print then each cell will be colored. Now the next step is variable declaration where I have declared my final table type as ty data which I have declared above and I am declaring a variables it field catalog which is a field catalog where internal table and uh, work area and layout and work areas for style and colors as lvct underscore style and lvct underscore s call or internal tables and I am declaring one field symbol for modifying this it data internal table it's, it's for my convenience you can use work area also there is no problem now here I am simply getting the material details from MARA table I am simply getting 100 rows and I am filling it in IT data the first four columns then I am simply looping it uh, I want to make uh, if the material unit of measurement is EA or KG if it is EA I want to make that cell as disabled no means it should not for editable if it is a kg I want it to make for editable and so for that we need to fill the style work area if you see the style work area we need to pass the field name if you understand clearly this style and color internal tables are deep structured means in single work area in single line we have material number uh, material group material type and unit of measurement along with two internal tables of style and color so we we are passing the field name and the style what is the style here this is the style 
MC style disable means this will disable that field for editing. I am passing for only EA unit of measurement. Now I am appending this work area to final table work area. As I told you, style is an internal table. So I am appending this work area to this internal table. So it, as it is a field symbol, when we append this here, it will automatically update in the final table. Likewise, I am passing colors. For EA unit of measurement, I am passing red. For KG, I am passing green. And